Peace, everybody. Hello. How we doing? Hope everybody's all right. I am kind of ecstatic. I'm doing an unboxing right now. I don't know if I mentioned this in any of my previous videos, but I purchased a trampoline. A mini trampoline. And they just dropped it off a couple of minutes ago. So ah, we're doing an unpacking of my trampoline. And perhaps I'll go over some of the benefits of it when I'm all done. But uh, this is a I don't think it's AMS deal. Let me make sure it's AMS deal. Uh, AMS deal. Yeah, it's an AMS deal trampoline. And the model number is HCMT026A. Let me say that again. Hector Charlie Man Television 026 Apple. <laughs> and it's a uh, trampoline. Now, they say I need to be unboxing this with two people because the spring tension is it's really, really something else and I could get hurt. So I'm not going to continue playing this video because you won't be making no damn viral video of me getting whacked in the face or the head or getting knocked out <laughs> putting this sucker together but I did just want to provide some content to my members only um, I don't think the general public is going to see this they don't need to see this this is for members only this is this is what Bud does you know I'm sitting here at home waiting for the uh, mechanics to come to repair my furnace um, I usually do it on my own, but I've got to a point where, you know, I stay in my lane. I know as much as I can do. I've cleaned filters. I've um, I've reset the the um, coils, the electrodes. You know, I've changed the um, the ignition or the 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 oil flow ignition switches and all that. I, I've changed the uh, the CAD. I've changed a lot of stuff. It's a Beckett furnace so I've done what I can do I've gotten to a point where I can't do anymore it won't remain lit and it's a situation where I don't want to force something to happen I don't want to force it to come on and my house start filling up with you know carbon monoxide so it's time to call the, um, you know, the mechanics in for four years I've been fighting with it and getting it to work and making you know making do but it's gotten to a point where I've exhausted all of my um capabilities I need somebody I need a pro in here for that so that's what I'm doing and while I'm waiting for the mechanic I'm coming up with ideas and concepts with some of my businesses and they just happen to deliver my trampoline so this is what I'm doing in my free time this is what Bud does and um when it's fully assembled I'll come back and perhaps I'll show you some exercises that I've uh, looked into because this mini trampoline and the battery's going low. This mini trampoline is incredible when you're looking to, you know, get more fit. Um, I'm a calisthenics buff. I like, you know, I like free weights. I like to, you know, do the, the, the push-ups and the dips and different things. And I'm not so much of a jogger. However, there's a cardio aspect that I need to actually consider because I'm 48. I'm not getting any younger. And this is going to provide it. The cardio, the full body, the strengthening the core. This is it. So when it's fully assembled, I'll be back. And we're back. It's my Brownsville. Back again with the AMS deal. Trampoline. And we got it opened up. Now, I... Remember reading some of the warnings and that's coming out backwards. I'm gonna to have to fix that. I remember reading the warnings about 
um, I guess they were talking about disassembling the trampoline, how you're going to need two people. Uh, I'm a fairly strong guy, so I didn't need two people to put it together. And I thought I was going to need two people. So I was like, let me let me just attempt to, and I'm not going to hurt myself. I want to, you know, see how much pressure I, I need, and perhaps I need two people. But no, once you extend it, it stays extended. You put the pins in, and it's fine. Now, this is simple. Absolutely, positively, that spring force, you don't want to pull that pin out and try to close this on your own. This is a portable one, so, you know, once I'm done or if I want to put it aside, like, this is not one of those you want to take apart and put up every day. <laughs> no. So when I do want to, let's say I want to come and do a, uh, a seminar, and I want to show some examples of what you can do with the, uh, the portable trampoline. And it's called a rebounder. <laughs> it's a rebounder. Anyway, um, perhaps then I'll take it apart, put it in the car, and bring it, and then reassemble it there. But I'm going to continue putting the legs on this thing, set it up right here, and let you see some stuff. All right? So, again, I'll be back. Okay. And I'm putting on the last two legs. We're getting there. We're getting there. Funny thing is, <laughs> I'm not going to be able to give you a demonstration today. Or at least not right now. Because if I get on this trampoline and I got sweatpants on and my wife sees me jumping on the trampoline with sweatpants on. She's going to be hot. And, okay, let me tell you why she's going to be hot. Not so much that I'm jumping on a trampoline with sweatpants on, but I'm making a video to play for other people. Oh, she ain't going for that. <laughs> I, I can just imagine her now. So... I'm going to set this thing up and show you what I can show you, <laughs> but uh, not in those sweatpants jumping on this trampoline. <laughs> uh, all right, so this is the last leg. Tight, 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 and tight. And there you have it. It's the AMS deal. Try to put the shorts on. Like I said, I can't, you know, show you guys me jumping on my trampoline. But uh, this is the Amzil. You might want to get you guys, you know, get yourself one. I'll show you the, some of the things that these things can do and show you what they're for. All right. But Brownsville, members only. Appreciate you guys.